say another review. This time's on the points, point motors, and signals part two, and or unless you want to call it update two. Uh, this is the final one of this. Finally, um, you saw me unboxing the uh, accessory decoder last video and this video is talking about how it all works so as you can see this one here was broken but um, by magic the engineers managed to get it working for me to use so this one controls the points over there this one controls the points now in the station this one controls the point in the station as well this one hasn't changed, this one hasn't, this one hasn't, but this one is a new signal. So, if I just pick up the camera and move it, you can see the signal over there, that's new. You can see the point there is now going to be working. There's the accessory decoders, what I was talking about. So, if I get to my computer, if I move the camera up, so, as we've got the e-link system, uh, if I zoom out like that, you can see I called it as my name, um, apparently, it's just a random map I just made, um, so what you want to do, if you want the points to work, you just click on this arrow here and what it does is changes the point if the camera zooms in and focuses on there after not the camera quite a bit of time. So, if I do that again, um, you see it changes it. So the message is coming from this decoder to this point here, and it sends it to that. That's how all the points are working. And so if I just quickly switch over to here, uh, these are now all working like last time so remember the last time the end one was not working but now operates the point if I just move the camera to show you it operates the point right here as you can see I'm sorry about the light of it um, you can see it's just dark outside so I can't do anything about the light. So, uh, so all the points, if I come back to the e-link system, uh, now functionally work. So this one is the sliding you keep seeing. Um, that's now working by hitting these buttons here. If I just zoom in the fight go and bring it to this point here uh, it shows it's going straight yes it's going to but if I hit this button here it sends a message down the track to change the point but sometimes this error happens like this so it stops working like that so I can do it on that because there's no point motor or the accessory decoder, same on this one. So this one here has got accessory decoder on and you can see it drops down. And so if I click back on that, it will reset the points for how you want it. So it means next couple of videos you see 
all these trains going from here, going all the way around, and then coming back. Means a train will come in from over there, run all the way around, uncouple here, verse that way, change the point, the local will run round, all the way along there, and then come back and couple back up. And the same on the other side. So thank you for watching this review. Please subscribe to my channel. Please click like if you like this video. Thank you.